How's it going guys? So today I'm going to be making these campus board holds for grip strength training. It's a pretty simple build, uh, so let's get started. The first thing you're going to need is some 3 inch PVC pipe. Uh, you really can get whatever size you want as long as it fits your hand. Uh, you want to make the width of it a little bit wider than your hand, just so that your thumb will be able to fit on it. Mine is about 5 inches, and then you're just going to mark that off for where you're going to cut it. We're also going to need to draw a line on it. That's going to be for something else later on. It's important. Just just do it. Just just do it. And go ahead and cut it out. So fast at cutting. I mean, I mean that's definitely real time, guys. Man, I should be getting an award. All right, so now we're just gonna take some sandpaper here and clean up the end. It also kind of helps so you don't cut your hand on it if you file it down a little bit. I'm just using 220 grit. So we're going to take the line that we drew earlier and we're going to mark off on the other side so we can get a better reference of where we're going to draw the line. Just try to get it as even as possible. You want to cut this piece in half eventually. Then draw the guideline. And now we can put it in the oven. Alright, so this oven is set to 250 degrees Fahrenheit, and we're just going to put it in there for about 15 to 20 minutes. It really just depends on what oven you have. Then we're going to take it out and get a sharp knife. The sharper the better. Mine isn't very sharp. Uh, and just cut down the middle. Cut it in half as best as possible. Like, you can tell that my knife isn't sharp because I'm doing this over my leg and it hits pretty hard like that and it, like, no cut whatsoever. Then just put them back in and reheat them, uh, probably for 5 to 10 minutes. It just reshapes them. Now, you can really put these in whatever way possible. My drill bit isn't really long enough to get the like 8 inch depth that it needs so I'm gonna be making a template that I can use for pre-drilling the holes just from some scrap wood and that's gonna go on top of the PVC pipe and we're gonna drill some holes into it Okay, so now that that's done, what you would do is put the template down and drill, pre-drill the holes so that they're even, and then you can just take your piece and then screw it in. For the grip, we're going to be using some grip tape, and you just peel the back off of that and then stick it onto the top of the hold. This is pretty much the only thing that's going to be holding your fingers on besides your grip. Or, yeah, <laughs> your grip. Friction. Just like that. 
So the uh, screws that I'm going to be using are about 8 inches long, they're pretty long. Uh, they need to be able to go in all the way past your hold and then about four to three to four inches into your tree or I, I'm gonna be using a tree if you're making a board then do something different so I've put mine on this tree but you can really put them wherever you want I hope this video was helpful and gave you the knowledge to build your own campus board holds. See you next time.